Welcome back, everybody. Last weekend, I had the joy of running the annual FAL match down in Dawsonville, Georgia at Riverbend Gun Club. And uh, I want to start off by saying that this is the place that it all kind of happened for me uh, when it comes to the shooting competitions and things like that. Back in 2015, I had uh, uh, started by showing up at the, uh, the annual FAL match, the FAL match down in Dawsonville and uh, went down there and had an amazing time. And it was that event right there that actually sprung board my, me into a lot of these events that you see today that I do, like running guns especially. After meeting Matt and Bruce and everybody and making our initial journey from you know where we live all the way out to Oklahoma to do our very first running gun, well for me it all really kind of started right here, you know. All the shooting and everything that I had done prior, you know, whether it was in the Marine Corps just for fun and things of that nature, this is actually the first I would say competitive shooting event that I ever went to. So for the match director Bruce Perry, my hat is off to you. You held another amazing, another uh, great and amazing match this year. Um, just like every year, we've shown up and done this. So um, real quick, I'm not going to make this a really long video, um, but I did want to put that shout out to Bruce for hosting this amazing time that uh, every year a lot of foul. FAL or FAL owners come from all over the all over the country, sometimes the world, to actually come and compete in this event down in Dawsonville. So thanks again, Bruce, everything that you did. Uh, for the run itself, it's not actually like a lot of the running guns you see me do. This is more of a uh, kind of a single gun event. And uh, what you do is you run an action stage and then you run a uh, an accuracy stage, which is a lot of, a lot like a high power stage only it's a little bit different. Um, and for this match, um, um, what I like to do every year is I like to run the Argentine FL. This is the FL that my father gave me after I retired from the Marine Corps. This is an all-matching Pedro Bello import, um, pre-band Argentine FL, and uh, I enjoy running this gun especially at this match since this is where it all started for me. I only did one running gun with this and then I kind of have relegated it to just shooting it at the FAL match every year. I use the DSA FAL if I want to do a running gun with an FAL. So for this match I ran my dad's and it did great. Um, this year um, I placed second in the optics division. I was happy to place second, second only to the match director Bruce Perry who did an amazing job and uh, beat me. I was looking at the scores earlier and uh, I placed, uh, like I said, second in the optics and fourth overall. Another uh, felt really good. Matt, you know what I'm talking about. So um, with that, real quick, I'll talk about the, uh, the match itself. Like I mentioned earlier, it's broken out into a, a, an action stage, which is a lot like a kind of a three gun event. Just you only use one gun, you use the FAL. You need an FAL to run this match. And uh, Bruce puts you through the paces of several different kind of obstacles and shooting positions and things that you're going to do. And so a little bit of running. And, uh, and what happens is uh, that it will be 50% of your score, the run time. Um, uh, and then, of course, if you made all your hits, especially on the uh, targets that require pasting afterwards, if you missed any, well, then those count against you. So from there, um, you move on after everybody runs through the action stage, and we set up for the, uh, the accuracy stage, which is a lot like a high-power event where you're shooting at 100 yards, and you're going to do standing, sitting or kneeling, and then prone. Um, you'll do one magazine or three magazines of 10 rounds each, 10 rounds from standing, magazine change, 10 rounds from sitting or kneeling, magazine change, 10 rounds from prone. All right, make sure I got that. Pro, uh, standing, sitting or kneeling, and then prone, um, 10 rounds each in a, mag in a different magazine, and you do that all in three minutes, all right? So it's not all standing and then take a break, and then all sitting, take a break, and then all you know prone, take a break. It's all within that three minutes. So you have three minutes to put 30 rounds down range at a, uh, at a reduced sized official target. There's my group. So well, I did put the picture up here in a second. So after you do all that, scores are calculated. We also do a lot of side matches. Um, Bruce actually has uh, somebody come out and they do a Browning high power match off to the side. And that was a lot of fun. And we also do a drop eight where you try to drop eight pieces of steel under 10 seconds. And if you can do it under 10 seconds at 100 yards from prone, you win a coin. Two individuals and now, now only three of these coins in existence actually made that happen this year. And uh, so we have, uh, we have a few more of those coins out there. I am not one of them. It took me like uh, 13 or 15 seconds to actually hit the eight. 
So without further ado, I'll go right into the video. This is my action stage. And then uh, as soon as I get done with the action stage, I'll go right into showing you guys the accuracy phase or stage. So thanks again. Thanks again, Bruce. Like I said, I'm not going to do any closing comments and so make this a short video, but this is a great time. I think I'll end my comments right here before I go into the action and then the accuracy stage and say that uh, if you're watching this video and you own an FAL and you have never been to this match, I implore you, come next year. It's going to be in the spring. All right, so that's only going to be about six months away-ish. So uh, come on out. Have a great time. Uh, there'll be all kinds of FALs all over the place. You'll get to, you know check out and compare them to what you have. If you don't have an FAL, you want to come out and you're interested in getting an FAL, um, come out. I'm sure somebody out there will loan you an FAL. You'll probably just need to bring some ammo. So uh, without further ado, here's the video. Thanks again, you guys. Ready? Oh. <laughs> <clears throat> Where am I at? One more? Motherfucker. Porter. Yeah, yeah, one more point. That's it. Go, shut up. It's on safe. Damn it. Son of a bitch. Any head.
Oh, fuck me. Huh? Is the line ready? Is everybody ready on the left? Ready on the left. And I'm staring at the guy who's not. All right, ready on the right. Ready. All ready on the firing line. Load one magazine. You can close your bolt. Thank <laughs> you. 